Hey everyone, Brian with you from the game cabin. We are playing some more Planet Zoo, continuing with our sandbox mode, and we got our bears, man. We got our bears, and I was actually just like floating over this cliff, and that's so cool. Yeah, that's actually really, really cool. I kind of dig it. Um, I think I kind of want to go ahead and get some of these rocks, and I think we're gonna keep just duplicating this. I hope this doesn't like really lag out the game and stuff like that. I'm hoping like having rocks hopefully doesn't like really screw with, you know how busy the game is and stuff like that or like how long the load time is and stuff but i'm just trying to get this looking a little more realistic which that's looking pretty dang good there um a couple of these rocks can go away because you know a couple of these are a little too far out i think so something along the lines of that might work because i mean we do have some duplicates now um and i think maybe even down here we could probably get rid of a couple just trying to like better to have not enough than too many or I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I think that's mostly okay. So then let's grab all of this again and then let's duplicate that one more time and let's go put this on this side of the cliff and you know what we could do? Well, I mean, we're going to rotate it that way. So it's already going to be a little bit different. Um yeah. Yeah, cuz this is this is interesting cuz you know the rocks aren't exactly the same. Uh obviously you know, so like the whole plan for the rocks is going to be a little different. Ah, yeah, I'm trying to figure out how we best want to do this. So the thing is, immediately I'm seeing an issue where it feels like some of these are just like, just need to go back. And yeah, I mean, we could just do it like this, I think. Maybe that's just the best way. Is there an I? Is that what that button was? Is that I? Yeah, I should have that button memorized, I think. I. And so, like, we can just grab some of these, like, a bunch at a time, and then just start, like, moving some of this back in. Yeah. Yeah, some of these are just whoopsie. Gosh. <laughs> Don't hit I twice. Some of these are a little too far. Too many hockeys, man. Just a little too far out. So I think something like that. Let's get you back inside. How's that looking? Well, it's kind of like we got a, a, a cliff of rocks right now. What about, like, doing something like this? This might be a better option here. Manually selecting them. Did I duplicate? Or what the heck was that? Did I grab something from the underground stuff? I have no idea what I did. All right, let's try that. I'm gonna just delete you. Gonna delete you. There we go. <laughs> Apparently, it's not a uh, uh, backspace. Uh, grab you, grab you, grab you. We could probably move some of these as well. And then let's not forget this stuff on top, too. This really didn't work the way I wanted it. Yeah, this turned out to be a lot more work just to copy paste it than I thought it was gonna be. Shoot. Ah, dang it. I keep hitting I, man. Uh, when I mean to be hitting X just to move it. I'm not con I'm not I'm a little confused when it's actually trying to move. It must be selecting the building or something like that. That's the only thing I can think of because I don't know why else it would pop up. How's that? I think we just need to go ahead and move like just some of these here. And we probably are okay then. Like just get something like that, and then let's just get you like in as well, and let's bring you even up a little bit. Yeah, yeah, I mean, we still have some rocks sticking out. And I don't know how I feel about it. Obviously, you know, I don't really want these rocks sticking out as far as they are, but, you know, there's not really much I can do, I think, unless I want to sit here and spend 20 minutes adjusting this, which apparently that's what we're going to do. <laughs> uh, I'm trying not to. I'm really trying not to. But my perfectionism is really coming in. Uh, not so handy right here. I think I'm going to leave it like that. Uh, you know what? Let's just get rid of some of these. Yeah, let, why don't we just do that? If we have too many rocks and the rocks are sticking out, let's just delete some. And that might look better. Because remember, we do have like duplicates here. Nah, I think I can leave that one in. I think that one's okay. Just trying to get rid of some of these larger ones, especially that are just kind of like off in the middle of nowhere. Um, I think something like that's a little better. The only thing I don't like about this is I want some of these rocks here. Yeah, I sh that's what I should have done from the get-go. Let's 
is we should have just moved rocks one at a time or multiple ones at a time instead of all at once. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Okay, I can dig it. I can dig it. Uh, one thing we should look at, though, before we go away is let's look at habitat. Let's get the bear. Let's make sure that the bear has no ability to escape. So it says that he could potentially walk and escape. Apparently, this is slightly outside our barricade. All right, edit barrier. I mean, good to know. Good to know. We can just move this, like, here, and then I think we're okay. I mean, the odds of the bear walking right there are pretty rare. <laughs> But just to be fair, we should go ahead and move uh, the point right there. Boom! What's up? <laughs> Habitat cleanliness is a risk. This one? We literally just made you. How are you dirty? How are you dirty? Actually, I don't need the vet. Cancel that. How are you so dirty? Literally just threw you down, buddy. Literally just threw you down and you're already having dirty issues. Um, you know what? Screw it. Zoo, give me another keeper. Hey, buddy. Go fix this, please. Thank you. So, we talked about, in the last episode, putting wolves here. The other option is we also could put some wolves down here. What other snow things do we have? We have the monkeys. You know the monkeys are going to be so much cooler up here. Yeah, the monkeys are going to be so much better up there. Uh, what monkeys were they? Uh, because we've not really done any monkeys yet. We could do more doll sheep, but nah. Uh, it's not the pandas. There it is. The Japanese maka, uh, make, 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 I don't know. Um, they don't really need a large spot. They're Japan, Asia, so those trees probably aren't going to work. So we're going to want to move them. They're promiscuous. Yeah, I think we put them here. It's gonna be a little bit better for... I think it's gonna be a little bit better. Mm -hmm. I really wish I could put something in the bear, some nature stuff, that would be nice. Uh, we have a VIP. I can't say hi. Toilet block 23 is free, he's happy about that. I don't like how this area looks. Uh, okay. You can't see reindeer. I don't know where you're at, buddy, but you know, I got some pretty good views of the reindeer, man. I really probably should just do the view all the way along, but whatever, whatever, whatever. I'm not going for like the most, um, the greatest zoo here. I'm going for a little bit more of a, uh, a realistic one. Okay, so we are doing wolves. What says wolves? Brick? What about the stone? I think I actually like the idea of the stone here. There's no curve on these. So, you know what that means? Brick time. It's gonna be brick. I think I have to actually move you up before I can actually get the curve going. And then we're going to rotate it. I'm not sure I actually like how this is working here. Can I delete you? No, no, no. What? What? No, 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 no. Delete. Go. Come on. Edit barrier, buddy. No, move. Nah. 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 I hate it. I hate it. This looks terrible, man. This looks terrible. I think we should just go straight line and be done with it, because... This is not working out too well for us. So, let's get you going. Now you actually look like you're doing a curve. It is kind of doing a curve here. We'll do something like this. This will be fine. Um, we do have the potential view uh, on these windows, but I think what we're gonna do is go ahead and finish all this, and then we're gonna uh, go from there. Then you can see that everyone's kind of cold here. I would like to take care of that. We talked about making all of this in an actual building. Where's my pathway going? Probably don't need this any larger than this. In fact, we could merge it up over there. Yeah, it should be big enough. We're gonna end up putting some more village stuff here. Something like here. Yeah. I am, I am definitely thinking we want 
Uh, brain thought. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. We're busy. So we are gonna... We want to connect that path. So we gotta move all that back just a little bit. Because I do want to connect this path up. That was just kind of bad on my connections. Um, yeah, this is gonna be fine for what we're doing. But, um, I think we want to put all this inside. Because, like, if I put the heater here, I think it might be too large. I don't know, actually. I don't know if I really want just, like, heaters lying around everywhere. That that seems kind of dumb. But then building buildings through all of this is going to be ridiculously difficult. Because, I mean, we're doing curves, you know, walls. Like, this is going to be really hard to actually build buildings here. We could just do a sporadic group of buildings, perhaps. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let's think about it. Let's not make any decisions quite yet. Okay, so we're going to grab all of you guys. And then I want all of you to move in. About right there should be good. And then let's move you. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Give me the end. Give me that end piece. Give me that end piece, please. Yeah. And then I want to move all of you a little wider. Come on. No. No. Dang it. No, dang it. Let's get rid of you. So what am I trying to do here? I'm trying to straighten this out a little bit. Okay, game. Thank you. Because you can see this isn't particularly straight right here. I don't want to add. I just want to move. Do we want to have... I think that's good. Let's just move this one. Do we want to have any pathways inside the thing? I don't think so. Nah, I don't think so. I think this is going to be adequate for the wolves. Um, so now we need to look at and decide where we want viewing areas. I definitely feel like you should be a viewing area. Like, that's prime right here. And that's prime here as well. And I think even this one should be pretty good. Um, are we gonna do the pathway around the side? I think so. I think we will have the pathway go that way. Speaking of pathways, let's go you. And then I like the idea of going wolves here and then that's just kind of like the initial. Yeah, okay. Then we don't need any pathways over here because quite frankly, um, we're not gonna have anything over here. So let's get our trash can moving. Let's go ahead and grab a pathway and I want I think we should I think we still have the same path going Okay, let's go like this And I will do size one just to make it work, right? Wait, I thought we weren't actually gonna do this then we should do view over here. Ah shoot Hmm. Hmm. Do we want to connect that up? I'm going to say no. Yeah, I'm going to say no. I think eventually you can go that way and we can have something else happening over there. I think for now, I don't think we need it. This is a cube, Ryan. <laughs> Let's maybe not do a cube. The cube's. You know, not exactly what I was looking for here. What? 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 What are you actually doing here, buddy? What are you actually doing here, buddy? I am so confused right now. What the heck are you doing? All right, yeah, that that works. <laughs> that works so much better. Um. And then I should go ahead and throw a couple more buildings over here. Uh, facilities. We're going to go to staff facilities. We're going to do quarantine. Uh, let's do keeper hut large. And it's like a continuation of the river. Or sorry, of the village. But, you know, I think it's going to be okay. Then we wanted a staff center large. I like the idea. Yeah, let's do a pathway here. Um, just trying to mix things up with visual facilities. 
not research center staff center we don't really need research center which is kind of the only thing that sucks about i wish you could do a franchise mode where you have unlimited money but you still have to research i mean that would be nice we're gonna do that i'll do a workshop here just for the heck of it yeah just so we can finish all these and then we'll just do a small quarantine i don't know if we did a large one before so it's just like a little bit of a village over here there. And I suppose just to make it look a little more legit. Oh, we got the exhibit buildings too we could do at some point. I don't want the shops. I just want the plain buildings. Where are the plain buildings? What were those under? Construction. I remember. So we're just gonna do a couple more buildings here. Like, I think having like one near the lake will be fine. Um, I think like having like one here. Do something like this. I know I'm expend extending the village more than I want to, but it is what it is. Is that the front? That is not the front door, Brian. <clears throat> I thought that was gonna be the front door, okay. Does that look like it's still... Yeah, it's just like an extension of the village. Kind of gives me a banish feel to it. It really does. Now, the only thing is our wolves. Um, It's kind of a boring area for our wolves. It really is. It's just a big flat area. Did any climbing or anything? No. Grade 2 fence. We definitely have that. How do we want to jazz this up? Very good question. Let's start by looking at the wolf. See what we got here. Arctic shelter. I mean, this is actually kind of cool because it fits really well with what's happening right there. Yeah, I can dig that. <laughs> I like the pinata. <laughs> ah, that's cute. Yeah, that's cute. Okay, uh, give me the bedding large. Give me the extra large bedding. I don't know why. I don't know what's the point of any of the smaller bedding. <laughs> Literally only use extra large bedding, man. Only use it. Nah. Nah, Brian. Crap. Crap. Nah. No. no, we we can't do that. We oh shit. Are we really going to do this? I don't want to do this. Okay. So, immediately my brain's like What if we put this inside the enclosure? Follow me here. What if the village, the Arctic village is actually a part of the enclosure? We can even give them some water to go into. Just to really make it unique. But are people gonna be able to see them now? Brings up a very good point. The answer is probably not. Yeah, the answer is probably not, right? Nah, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I think it's a cool idea. I think it's a unique idea. I don't think I want to do it. I don't think it's going to work the way I want it to. So then how else can we go ahead and make this a little more on the unique side? I think for starters, let's go ahead and get some terrain going up here. And I know we're blocking off our view. That's kind of actually the point here. Um, and you will see here in just a second. Um, let's actually bring you back down. Now let's just flatten the foundation. 
Um, I actually don't necessarily want it over like that. So let's lower this, let's lower the size a little bit. And yeah, let's get you back over the barricade. I think that's good. And then I want to go ahead and dig this up, dig this back out. Oh, we gotta go a little bit bigger than one. But we need to increase this. So essentially the goal here is to take you all the way to the exit or the, the glass. And then this is gonna be kind of more bedding area or just a cave area, really. Um, that should be a two-way glass, by the way. Where do we go? Where do we go? Where do we go? How do we end up over here? Yeah, so I like the idea of just making this like a little cave. We can take you down a little bit too, just so the roof will fit. You think they want water? I don't know, it's a good question. Let's bring you back, because there's no reason to be that high. Sure. Now this, I don't know, is doing what we want it to do. I think there's gonna always be just that little bit of exchange between the two, a little bit of spot. Yeah. Yeah, I think there's always going to be just a little spot there. So, I think it's got to just stay. Alright, that'll work for now. So, what do we want to do with this little area? Well, I think, number one, I'm going to take you up over here. I want to put a little bit of a lake area. It's going to be just like a little lake inside the thing. Just like a little pond. In fact, I would totally have fishes there for the wolves to chase after and eat. But, you know. So give me just a little bit of a pond in here. That is way too big of a pond. That is not big enough of a pond. Let's bring you up just a little bit more. Still not big enough. Okay, I think that's it. Nope. Come on, come on game. Yeah, there we go. So I just wanted a nice little pond here so they can come and swim in there. It's kind of like, you know, this nice little area for them to go hang out. <laughs> then go swim. It's beautiful. It's beautiful, man. It's beautiful. And let's go ahead and smooth all of this. They can walk up to the window and actually see guests if they so care about. You know, if they desire. If they desire. Raise this up. I don't know about the long grass, though. Then we also have this flat top area here, which I'm not necessarily a huge fan of. So I think we're just gonna go ahead and raise a little bit just to have it uh, mixed up just a little bit. And then some nice little smoothing here. Um, Arctic wolves are gonna be what? Okay, sweet. And they're North American. All right, so I can actually get my trees working in this one. Great. I should just go ahead and move all those trees to begin with. Probably. Probably. So biome... Uh, no, no, no. Just... Uh, no. 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 Wait, where's my arctic biome? Huh? What? What? Oh, it was tundra? Was it tundra this whole time? No! What? Huh? Am I missing something here? Aquatic? Was there not Arctic earlier? Yo, I gotta go back to the last episode. This is confusing to me. I could have sworn there was an Arctic button. Could have sworn there was an Arctic button. Hi, Brian. Yo, go to the planting trees. We're on Tundra. Tundra is here. Give me like one other big one. Am I stupid? I think I'm stupid. Okay. No, no, no. It was Tundra. It was Tundra. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, but those are Asia. That's the issue. So we went North American Tundra. That's what threw me. There's no North American Tundra here. 
Well then. Um, also, I don't think they are Tundra now that I look at it. Yeah, Taiga too. Okay. All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. Brain just like totally had an issue there. Uh, and then we'll do Taiga too. Just because I want some larger trees here. I'll do some of these firs. That's fine. Some Douglas firs. That's okay. Do some Douglas firs. Just, you know. Whoopsie. <laughs> kind of make this look like it's a forest. Probably not so many of the same height would be my kind of thought here. So it's almost like, I mean, honestly, this kind of looks like uh, Star Wars, like Endor here. I just want like a nice little forest here at this one part. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, we got these festive spruce. I don't really care so much about that. Um, don't mind throwing just a couple of these other ones in there. Just to get some randomness going. Just so it looks a little more like a forest. Because usually there's not one type of tree all the way through. Those are not Douglas firs, by the way. Oh, uh, that's probably way too much coverage. <laughs> ah, maybe. Maybe. Go ahead and throw some, and then we're gonna put some moss in the ground too. Cause, I mean, I'm assuming they live in the forest. These are all large. So, if this is gonna be the forest, there should be some moss and stuff on the ground, right? This is something along the lines of like that. And the trees spread out a little bit. And we're gonna put just like a couple of these other firs around. Maybe some bushes. Do we have like some small bush? Yeah. Yeah, I'm okay with like that. Let's put like that one here. And then give me just like a group of bushes here. With the single yellow cider. Okay, I mean, that looks kind of like a forest. Kind of, kind of. So let's go ahead and add some enrichment items in here. We should go ahead and get our um, doggies here pretty quick as well. Um, let's put the food like right there in the middle of the forest floor and then we'll put another one over there. We'll do like a box. I don't know, what is this one? Gift enrichment box. Huh, interesting. I wonder what happens if you do ice. Like, if we made it colder in here, what would they, what would happen? Do that, I definitely want the pinata, man. Pinata for sure, I'm gonna put the pinata in here. <laughs> Cause that just looks fun. Okay, then let's do some water here and we'll do some water in the forest as well. Something like that, something like that, perfect. So, let's go ahead and get ourselves some arctic wolves, please. Any species, American bison, or uh, arctic, A-R, oh yeah, they're at the bottom. Not alphabetical, arctic wolves. Uh, are they packs? Two to eight, eight females, eight males. So we should be able to have multiple ones, especially since they fixed the bug uh, where they don't like each other. So we're just gonna literally buy every one of these then. We'll have two and two, that'll work. Send a zoo. Animal storage. Grab all these, send to zoo. Okay, cool. We'll do delivery. We will animal facilities without power. Oh my gosh. Why do you have to be like this every time? Keeper, I will add another keeper over here because why not? Uh, and then we do want the power. Where am I gonna put the power? I'll put the power right here, it's fine. Man, I'm, I hate this, I hate this, I hate this. So, we want water treatment. Is that gonna be big enough? Yes, it will. Yes, it will. What? Oh, it's this side. Hmm, we're gonna have to actually take a pathway through here. Do something like that, just to make it work. 
And then facilities again. Give me water treatment. Here, transformer, there. Transformer, robots in disguise. Uh, hey, I wanna actually move this whole building, please. Just back, just like that. Eh, we can move it a little further. And then this should have something. Uh, split from group, move, duplicate, select group. We want to edit group mode. Uh, construction is exactly what we're looking for. We're just gonna throw some really quick stuff here. Um, obviously, we're still in the Arctic zone, so give me the Arctic zone. Um, the doors, I think, are gonna be very helpful. Decorative walls, interesting. Interesting, are we gonna do it? I don't know. Might as well just throw these down like that, just because it's easy, and then all I have to do is put one thing in the back. Unless we want to do, you know what? I'm actually gonna do that. It's like, unless we want to do a curb thing, which totally cool with, totally cool with. So we got that going, we got that going. We need to, I'm gonna do this. The thing is, they're gonna be able to change things with or without the door. Whether or not we have the door here. Uh, let's look for doors and windows. Let's go ahead and get the Arctic door going. Uh, can I have you align to surface, please? Thank you. That'll work. And then we're gonna put one here. Cool. We're gonna put a big window. Smack dab in the middle. And let's do some of this. We're just eyeballing it, really. We need the post is what we need. Yeah. Problem is, I mean, because we should really be framing this out. Laziness is really the problem. <laughs> uh, so let's take you up here. Let's go angle snap. Boink, boink. Take you back up. Take you to the edge. You know what, I'm gonna have a little bit of an overhang. I think that's fine. A little bit of an overhang here too. Uh, let's duplicate, let's take you on the other side with just a little bit of an overhang. And then we're gonna put one in the middle. And what happened to our one here? What happened to our one right here? What? Did I hit X? Oh my God, I freaking hit X, didn't I? <laughs> yeah, I freaking hit X instead of control X. So something like that. Sure. Is it ugly? Oh yeah. Do I care? Eh, not really. Not really. Now we hit the right button this time. And let's get you moved in here. Okay, let's go roofing. Give me the circle pieces. The circle pieces. And how do we want to do this? Hmm. What about going up? and up. Okay. That is not 100% straight. I need this just curve ever so slightly. We're gonna put you like here. Try and get some sort of symmetry here. That'll work. Uh, let's go back to walls and I need the triangles, which I'm actually now using again. This is like double triangle now. Except you're slightly wrong height, which is probably okay. Because all we have to do then is grab the short stuff. That's the decorative wall. We don't want that. Uh, where's the, there it is. Yeah, we can do that. Uh, and then come here do that. Then what are we going to do up here? I think we're going to do the same thing. But I need this grid different. Let's try this. Because there should be 
overhang. Arches, columns, structural props, columns, arches. Yeah, it should be this, just the eave. Hmm. Do we have a one meter eave? That was a two meter eave. Yeah, there we go. That's what we're looking for, the one meter eave. That's the wrong side. Okay. And then we have this little thing right here, which is actually perfect for us. Uh, because I think what we're gonna do is, where's my posts, my columns, my decorative? Give me the angle snap, and we're gonna do this so there's like texturing. Yeah, let's actually do the full size one. Okay. Yeah, I dig it. I dig it. I dig it. Okay. Brian, you once again have mastered this game. Beautiful. Let's do that, and then let's put you right here. Good. And are they straight? Yeah. I like it. I like it. This needs something down here. We almost need, okay, I was gonna say, we need an awning or something. That's a shop face, shop face, Arctic shop. Ah, man, I hate this. I don't think I like these, though. This might just be too much. Maybe? Yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad. We need something right here. Mm -hmm. We definitely need something right here. Uh, Let's do the same thing. What was that under? That's under columns, which is gonna be under architecture. And what about actually doing this here? Blink, blink, blink. Nah, give me that. I think that's fine. We could try doing some shorter ones, but I think this is good. It's just like it's being held up by these two. The only thing is the triangle aspect of this up here is a little plain. So we could use something up there. We got these beams. I don't remember where the actual beams are. Yeah, I don't know where the beams themselves are. Structural pots. They must not be there. Eh, I forgot about these things. I mean, why not, right? Still need something through here. I wish this was a, like a longer piece. That'll work, that'll work. What is it? I have no idea, but visually it looks cool. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what it looks like, but visually it's okay. It's okay, it's not cool, it's okay. And then I'm gonna put these on each side, mostly because they look like reindeer horns. And now it looks like Jeff. It's Jeff's building. Let's go. All right, whatever. I'm spending way too much time on a building that has zero significance here. Uh, you know what would also be great? Torches. Those would be under light, like. Uh, they just use the wall lights, I bet. Uh, so yeah, let's put a torch here. Oh crap, I gotta add it. Yes, add and add. Okay. Good, 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 good. So then when we pop here and we go nighttime, yep, we got the torches, man. Now, obviously the pathway should go over here and you know what, screw it. We might as well take the pathway over here. I mean, there's no reason not to. Yeah, then it just looks like the pathway's going to everyone's house. Sweet. Uh, yeah, let's keep the game on pause. Let's wait for the wolves which should be incoming. Mr. Wolves, I don't know where you be, but you be here soon, I hope. Uh, we could speed things up, but I kind of like it. Do we really like it going up and then down? I don't know. I don't know about this. I don't know about these stairs here. The other thing, and we still hadn't done it, we talked about it. At some point, we should look at doing some transport rides. And I don't know what I want. 
Probably not the adventure, maybe the train or the gondola. Yeah, either the train or the gondola is going to be the way I want to go. And, I mean, this would be a really legit place to have a gondola station here. Or maybe actually right up here. Yeah, this would be a pretty nice spot to end the gondola station. Because then, yeah. 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 And then you can have a gondola coming up over here on the mountains. Coming then over here, getting the view of my sheep. Coming down the mountainside, and then around and over here. Yeah, I think that's our next option, man. Oh, we're at 40 minutes. We gotta wrap this up. But I'm pretty sure that's gonna be the next thing we're gonna do. Hello, where'd you at? Where are you at? Oh yeah, you're over here. I was like, I don't know where my door is, man. Yo, what's up, buddy? Hello. I wonder if my Jeff. Uh, a doubtful, but I wonder if my Jeff had kids yet. You hate all of these, really? Really? Okay, so they're 98 on the habitat. Screw it. I'm leaving it all. I'm leaving it all. Doesn't make sense, man. Oh, because they want Arctic again. So you know what? Maybe there's a bug there then. There might be a bug or something. So in that case, screw it. Screw it. Let's put these trees in here. The bears aren't going to like it, but it shouldn't affect them, it looks like. That tree is not doing what I want it to do. Um, keep in mind, we're going to have the monkeys right here. So the monkeys are going to have a completely different opinion. They're not going to like these trees. So that's why I think I'm okay just moving all these trees here for now. Yeah. I mean, at least a good portion of them. We probably should have a giant Christmas tree at some point, too. Like... Where was that giant Christmas tree thing? It's under construction. We have a giant Arctic nature thing. There it is. Let's have the Jeff, the top Jeff, facing that way. And I mean, that's pretty legit here. Only thing we could add to make this even better would be the Christmas trees. Right at the feet, or the Christmas boxes. Did they build these? Yeah, these are just shapes they made. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. How do we like that? I don't know. I don't know. We'll let it fit for a time being. We'll see what, uh... We'll see how we feel on it here in a little bit. Did I hit Y? I think I hit Y and that's been our camera issue. So you're gonna hate this, but you should still be okay here. Social's fine. They don't have enough space? What? Uh, when you do everything for these guys and they still isn't enough, man. Still isn't enough. Well, okay, let's, we gotta wrap this episode up. Screw it, give me, give me two minutes. Give me two minutes here, game. So I wanna go a little bit like that. Yeah, that's fine. And the thing is, this one right here. I think we can actually adjust you. No, I didn't want that, I'm trying. I hate how they appear on top of each other. That's probably the most annoying thing in the world. Okay, that works. We're gonna need a little bit more water, obviously, at some point. But for now, there's not really a whole lot we can do with it. Okay. Is that going to completely bust it? Probably, and they probably have zero space now. Uh, where are we looking? Here. Ooh, so close. Yeah, we still need more water. We still need almost 700 water. Golly, man. What if we put it down here? Do you think that would, like, screw them up? I have no idea. I have no idea. Yeah, I really don't know. Like, if I just make this part of their cage? Maybe not, because it's probably not accessible. Or it probably wouldn't work, because it's not accessible. What about actually putting this as part of their enclosure? The bridge? 
Eh. Nah. Because we could, and we could actually do this water, so it's like a bridge over trouble water. <laughs> no, but uh, seriously. And then, like, that could be the water, but I think, I don't think so. I don't think so. We could dig this back a little bit further. I don't think I want that. What about actually taking this back a little bit, and then maybe having this entire thing, like, just so it's inside, and then we go like this? That might be what we have to do. Where are we going to get the extra water? Probably just going to dig it out. Probably just gonna dig it out. The monkeys can probably sit like right here, and I think that'll work. And then I really, really do think we wanna work on the gondola here before too long. Um, how are we gonna have people, can people enter the Makabe? However you say it, can they enter their enclosure? Japanese? Yes. So we can actually just have a pathway going into it. Just like do, 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 and walk around it. Okay, well, I think we got a plan in place. Hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, drop a like, comment. Let me know what you think. As always, hit the subscribe button, join the game, comment, and share your support. I will see you guys next episode. Later, everyone.